save right now. It's always eating season but, in my house. But you know, we have choices we can make. You know, I, and there's all different kinds of appliances out there that we love. I mean, I, I love, a rotisserie oven is fantastic. I have pressure cookers, love all that stuff. But here's the bottom line. If you want to make your life easier, you really need to watch the next 15, 20 minutes of this presentation because this rotisserie has so many great features, so many bells and whistles. Imagine being able to cook right on top of the table a 15 pound turkey. And, and boy, wouldn't it be nice to have that extra oven around the holidays when oven space is at a premium Absolutely. and everybody's fighting you for the stove and all okay, that so stuff. So I gotta start with the fact HSN that- HSN launch yes. of the Easy Store Rotisserie. You're not seeing this anywhere else. Amazing features, easy to use. If you're a busy family, you gotta grab this right now. What? If you live alone, you gotta <laughs> grab it. Anybody. And if, and if you have no storage, this folds down yeah. to less than seven inches. Love it. Unbelievable. Now share this with you. you guys have seen me for years i do not cook i married somebody who helps me cook and he's great at this i make the best food in this my kids have gone nuts for the holidays there is not better choice than having this literally on your tabletop watching your food cook but the best part is the taste yeah so you see up to a 15 pound turkey in here this is what a, what a great way to start oh your holiday gosh. come on over everybody look and see how i'm doing my turkey oh. this is the biggest question i get as a fitness expert every year guy how do i cook my turkey and you know what when it sits in its own animal fat that's not the smartest way mm -hmm. here i'm going to show you how the fat drips off it rotates all your juices it's moist and delicious but enough talking let's get it eating miss mm -hmm. sherry who by the way Thank you, my darling. Mm -hmm. This is how easy this is. It comes right off of the spit. Now, I'm a big rotisserie fan. I got to tell you, I go to the, I go to the store. If right. you ever go to the grocery store and you buy one of these, mm -hmm. you know, they're good. But I'll tell you what, read the ingredients. All the things that are on this is not actually what you want to be doing. But check this out. In your home, I am talking moist and delicious. Let me cut this little piece for you. Mm. And I'm going to just do this. Do you guys see how literally how juicy it's this beautiful. is it's absolutely spectacular and the other thing is you i need a regular fork this is like a big <laughs> fork. you guys have a regular fork for me i feel like i'm going to skewer somebody oh, yeah 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 no but, well because you want to beautiful. taste a little piece of this well here's what we want to do you want to actually Good. flip this over I... that way all right see that's I... where the breast would be <laughs> Here. You think I'm You want me to do it? Okay, you think I do I'm this. Kidding. I did this for a living for a life. So, so this is, see, now watch. Okay, he just did uh, that a lot better, but you know what? <laughs> I cooked it. You, you did. It. And look at oh, wait, this. Look at all the juices watch falling this, off. Guys. Watch, okay. watch, watch. I'm going to pull oh, this gosh. little Can piece out. Can you put that on my plate? And I want you to look. Do you oh, see how I goodness. just enrolled Guy to cut for me? Oh, my, oh, gosh. my God. Look. Do me a favor, baby. Take this. Hold on. Watch. Oh, my. And that's not. You see what's coming out of here? This is the juice of the chicken. This is not the fat. In fact, Sherry, do me a favor. Where is this? Do you have the fat of the chicken? Oh, my gosh. Taste this for me. Oh, Baby, this is yeah. this has been this morning. Yeah. How yummy. Unbelievable. So juicy, so delicious. And then look, you see on the outside, it's you've crispy. got this caramelization on the yep. outside. In fact, even when you just open this, look at the juice. That is the juice that's look inside not there. The fat, you, you guys. see that? See how oh. it's running, and you can see how it's running clear oh, on the knife. God. That is so absolutely gorgeous. You will love it. Okay, so I'm going here, here too. Look Jerry's at that. Look got. at the meat come. <laughs> that's just crazy. You, guy, have you seen this? This is the this is the fat, by the way. That is not part of the juice. This is where it gets mm. healthy for you. It's moist and so delicious. That's unbelievable. But all of this fat, which mm. my God, my grandmother used to make gravy out of, and you can, mm. but when you roast your chicken in a pan, baby, yeah. It sits in its own animal fat. Exactly. That is not healthy for you. And, and when you put it in a rotisserie, that that inherent fat that is on the outside of a, of a turkey or a chicken or mm -hmm. any kind of meat that you do, that is going to circulate around the meat, and it's what help crisp, helps helps to crisp it up and helps to keeps it uh, very very moist too, which is why you'll go and you'll spend seven, eight, nine dollars on a rotisserie chicken. Again. Save yourself the money. These things are only about two, three dollars cost. You can go buy them yourself. You can pop them in your own oven. You can put them with whatever kind of seasoning you want. Okay. You will love them. By the way, I only have 2,400 of these to go around. They do come in three different colors. They come with the body color of blue, uh, the red. All, all stainless. Or the red. And then it comes in the red. And if you're buying it, you have to get the rotisserie cookbook that comes with it, or that goes along well, with I'll it. I'll tell you what, because there's have all available. these secrets in here, because it's not just chicken. We're going to show you vegetables. We're going to show you breakfast food. We're going to show you the most amazing. I can say this book, pick it up while I have copies. I won't be back till January mm. with this product. You don't want to miss this. I'll go through this in a little bit. But right now, I have to show you guys. And a guy's actually cooking my, oh, I love it. I'm You're just, carving mine. Oh, yeah. Look at how beautiful But let me share you is. something. Guys, can you give me another fork, please? Because I got mm -hmm. this big skewer thing here. The reason people don't eat vegetables is because they taste terrible. Have you ever tasted a roasted Brussels sprout? Oh my gosh. Caramelized and delicious. Usually really crunchy. I mean, you guys can see the texture of this. Mm. Yeah. Not soaking in fat. Mm. You get the basket. I know, I'm going to eat. I'm just going to eat and talk. I'm mm. just... 
you get the basket with this. Let me show you about the basket. This basket, isn't that good? Mm. Unbelievable. I mean, let me, sorry, I've just been eating, I'm loving I it. I know, both of us are. No more putting food mm. in my mouth. Here's the thing about the basket. It is, <clears throat> it is not just for vegetables. This also is for shrimp and hamburgers. But think of all the vegetables that you would like roasted. Roasted beets, roasted peppers. Oh yeah, potatoes, anything that you could, anything that you could put in a regular oven, try in a rotisserie oven, because you're oh. gonna get that great flavor. It's even delicious. Even cooking. Okay, mm. so let me take this, and let's move on to our, you know what, I wanna, I wanna show you guys how easy this is. Will you come here for a second? Sherry, mm -hmm. do me a favor, if you would take this away, from here, yeah, I'm we'll gonna come over because I want to share some everything you get. Well, this is what's amazing. Not only everything that you get, because you're gonna mm. get your entire rotisserie, which really is a set it and forget it product. But you're also gonna get your your flavor injectors. Mm -hmm. Now, when I used to see Ron Popeil do this, I love the idea that you could inject your flavor, your marinade, your garlic. You also get the gloves, which makes it very easy. You get the basket. Now, check this out, guys. This is how mm. you do it. This just comes off. If you want to store this, because you don't have a lot of space in your kitchen, yep. Watch you this. simply do this. I love and it. And then wait, no, hell, hang on to that. The legs come down, which actually Tamara was looking. She said, God, that's so nice the way it leans forward. It is like this, and that is how deep it is. It fits in most kitchen drawers. Yeah. That's the problem with the old one. It was so big. Yeah. But if you had this, you could easily take it. Oh, wait, here's my here's my little ruler. Check this out. It is seven, seven inches. Seven inches above. Yeah. So that stores anywhere, because you usually want space for this. Here's my idea, though. I don't put this thing away. It is so beautiful. You take the two legs, and you pull them out like this. Those mm -hmm. my legs. And you simply put this on top. How easy is this? Pop it in. Then, we also, new and improved Ronco for the launch. You simply turn it on. You set your hours, your minute. You decide if you just want it to rotate or roast or sear. You set it and you guys truly forget it. For a chicken, it's 15 minutes per pound. You guys have dinner. Here's my secret. My kids come home from school. I take a chicken. I have them help me. We pick the seasoning of the day, whether it's barbecue or lemon pepper, and then we kind of massage the chicken, inject it with some flavor, put it in here, watch it rotate. When they come down from doing their homework and taking a shower, dinner is ready. And if you want a healthy, wonderful family, not only for you and your own body, but it's eating together a meal that you made fresh. All right. All right. Listen, I'm over here and I'm marveling at everything you have back in here because yep. you can actually do desserts in here. We've got peaches that are actually roasting inside and peaches are fantastic. I do a lot of uh, peaches and fruits outside on the grill, do you? but you can't do that all year long. What's nice about having the rotisserie grill, you can do this anytime you want. We've got prime rib in here. We have lamb in here. We've got racks of ribs over here, but let me uh, let me have uh, Forbes show you exactly how easy this is to okay. do, so go ahead. And you, got, you saw how well I cut the chicken, right? Yeah, yeah. I really, a neophyte in the kitchen, but my kids go, Mommy, you make great food. You simply season up your chicken. Now, by the way, a couple of other things that you can do. These come included. It's a 1999 yeah. value. You've got your injector for flavor, or you can take your your garlic, and you can actually just kind of inject it into the chicken anywhere under the skin. Yep. We actually have gotten into massaging my chicken and getting under the skin. Mm -hmm. You simply take your chicken like this. You simply put it on the skewer, center it, and put it right here. So it goes right How down. yummy is that? This goes on. We're talking literally so easy. One and two. I'm done. All I do is I open up my rotisserie. I come over here and I take it and I set it. There's two settings, whether you want it near the heating element or not. You take mm -hmm. it like this. Oh, and you know what? This is a little carving tray. Can you kind of grab that, that little gray thing underneath for me? See that little yeah, gray? Yeah, gotcha, gotcha. That is your carving stand. Yeah, when you take it out, you want to put, put it on that and invert it. Okay, and then but you can watch this. We're talking easy. If I can do this, anybody can. You do this, you turn it on. You're going to set it for one hour. It's 15 minutes per pound. Here we go. We're going to set one hour here. You either have a choice of no heat, roast, or sear. I'm going to roast my chicken. Guys, this is what I do. You what? You set it and forget it. That's right. Say you, it again. You, you set it and forget it. You walk <laughs> away. You get to watch this in your kitchen. For the holiday seasons, you're going to be your own rock star. People are going to watch the food cook. You can't do this in an oven. It doesn't, it, there's nothing as much fun as this. Mm -hmm. And take a look. I mean, oh. this, these are the Ooh. kinds of results, and this is hot. Okay. But take, take a look at it. And you yeah. can carve right off this if you would like to. Yeah, that's I your mean, carving stand. Yeah, I would do it right off the top. And, and if on, you baby. love lamb, okay? But you know what? Who cooks it because they don't know how to cook it? Check it out. <laughs> is that delicious? There is nothing better. Nothing more delicious and juicy. Look at how this carves. Okay, you put I that mean, right here. That By the way, I also made this elephant garlic in my rotisserie. Check that out. Oh my goodness. Uh, you gotta taste that. You yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm a big, I, you know, it's funny, when I was a kid, I never liked lamb, and now I'm freaky for it. It's so dang good. Oh, come on, think about the holidays. Oh, I love the fact that we're eating with our, okay. Ooh, okay. Mm. This is food, this is, oh my God. This is so why good. I'm, my God, it's not talk while I'm food in my mouth. 
when you see all these great chefs that come on our network, I'm mm -hmm. not that. If you and I are not a chef, this is the product that you need so that you look like a chef. You make delicious food. My kids are so proud of me now. They're like, Mommy, Daddy used to do all the cooking, and now you make food. I don't pretend to be a chef, but this makes it easy. Yep, and juicy. Oh. Mm. And all you do, you know, you just put your seasoning on the outside, and then you can just carve it. Imagine you're at the holiday table, and you can pull this out, and you can just carve these beautiful strips of gorgeous lamb off for oh. you and your family, Ooh. and they will love it. And it's perfectly cooked. You can see how great that is. So here's the thing. Very, very busy right now. We know everybody is buying this. It's really one of the easiest ways you can cook anything. And you can do a uh, whole roast in here. You can do pork roast. You can do turkeys. You can do chickens. Uh, we've done a prime rib roast, which we've got back there as well. We're going to pull that out. And I'm telling you guys, this is, oh, my gosh. So here's ready? another thing. You talk about the cost of going out for dinner for oh, a prime rib. I'm going to let you cut yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, I used to do this in the restaurant all the time. To be able to serve a family like this and in your home. And you know why I'm so excited about it? because I never did this. I'm one of those who just always wanted to be able to cook like this. When you can set it and forget it, it's so easy. The new Ronk, oh, <laughs> seriously? <laughs> How good that is. And crispy that? on the outside. I'll cut another thin slice for you guys out there. Watch this, you ready? Okay, it is like you're working in a restaurant, by the Watch way. Watch this. Yeah, I used to actually I spent two hours in the kitchen on Saturday night cutting prime rib. But look at how beautiful that is. How and did you cook your prime rib, by the way? <clears throat> and a big, giant convection ovens. Okay. That's how so we used to do it. Giant <laughs> convection ovens. So now so. you're saving on electricity because you're not using that. This can sit on your counter. I love the look of the feel of this. The fact that it's crispy on the outside. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh all right. You know what we're going to move on to? Because we've got a lot of meat. After I take a bite of this no, no, prime no, rib. It's all about the food. Are you kidding? That's what the whole holiday season is. Perfect. Unbelievably perfect. I, I that is good. Oh, my gosh. That is unbelievable. Little I mean, seasoning on the outside. Seriously, seriously look how it's juicy it is. It's crunchy on the outside, too. Because you know why? This mm. is what rotisserie does for you. It cooks it all mm. the way around. It locks in the flavor. Perfect. It drips off the fat. This is the most unique product. I'm sorry, I mm. saw it on television for years, but the fact mm. that it's compact, it fits in your kitchen, and it makes food that's making his mouth water, mm. just imagine how much fun that is for your family to have their mouth water going, oh, mommy, look what you did. Look at this. Every time he cuts this, it's more and more exciting because the juice is just flowing out. There's not excess animal fat there. It just looks... Look it up perfect. God, you know this? You go to a restaurant for that, don't oh you? Oh, my gosh, yeah. You know what? And you spend a lot of money in a restaurant. You can do it yourself. And prime rib is one of those things that really loves rotisserie. There's certain foods that, that you know can be uh, can be a challenge, but not not in this thing because pr pretty much whether you use the kebabs or whether you're doing uh, lamb or you're doing prime rib, uh, you can do seafood because we have the baskets available. Uh, the basket actually comes along with it, so if you want to put salmon inside the basket, you can do that. What I'm telling you is very busy right now. If you'd like to get it, now's the time. If you want to cook things like this and not have to take up your regular oven space, maybe, I mean, I, I don't know about you, but I don't have a rotisserie in my home oven. No, I got the, nothing like no, that. and I'll tell you what, the, the, when you roast something, it sits in its own fat, so the juice tends to drip on one side, which is why it's dry. Mm. Yeah. That's why people used to complain about my cooking all the time. I'm now a rock star in my kitchen. How about homemade kebabs? Now, I know you only do this during the summertime when you can go outside. Mm. It gets cold in the wintertime, and you're like, oh, wait, I want to have, a, like, a fun kebab. I want to have some chicken. This comes, this is this easy. Look, you simply load on whatever vegetables that you love. How do you get vegetables oh, yeah. into your kids? This is the way to do it. Yeah. I have them all help me. Everybody loads their own kebabs. And there's, kebab. little, there's little stations. And for the, for do, the skewers, well, look, right? This is how easy it is. You simply put it right in here, and okay. you set it right here. This is oh, pop it on the other side. Pop it on the other side. I can't see this. Other side. Here we go. We snap it in there. Yeah. Again, you set it and forget it. Watch how right. wonderfully if easy this is. If you want, you can season everything just like, look at how simple. Bang. That's it. I That's love all you that. Do. And I just need to remind you that the, the fat tray lives right down here. Easy to come out. So easy to clean. We take this. You look at the recipe book. By the way, if you say, hey, wait a second, Forbes, I don't remember how long to cook this. Do me a favor. I'm going to reach over here. Grab my rotisserie book, please, because it tells you everything, the minutes that you need to do this. By the way, such a beautiful book. Everything from breakfast paninis to making seared ahi tuna. The pictures are beautiful. And even the roasted garlic, which I did over here. Have you ever had roasted romaine? I don't, you know what? I've done Again, I've done romaine on the really? grill, but I haven't roasted it uh, right on here. that rotisserie. But you can do all that. I want to show everybody one more time, Forbes. Go. 
how this, uh, uh, the footprint of this, because a lot of issues that people have with rotisseries is there's, where do you put them when you're done with them? They're like having another oven. But what's nice about this rotisserie uh, is the fact that it collapses upon itself. So basically the lid turns around and it stores inside and then you can put all your other utensils right inside. So it only takes up about seven inches of space. You could easily put this into a drawer and then when you're ready to take it out, you simply flip it over, you pop up the feet so it stands on an angle mm -hmm. like that and, and then you're good to go. Very simple as far as the controls. This has up to a three hour timer, which is more than enough time to cook pretty much anything you're gonna possibly cook. This is $149.95. This is the launch right here at HSN. If you buy it today, free shipping. And how about $37.49? Maybe you know somebody that just got married. Uh, you know, newlyweds having difficulty cooking. Maybe you know somebody that lives in an apartment and can't have a grill. Because a oh. lot of people cannot have outdoor grills that live in condos or apartments, but they still want to get that great sort of flavor that you get uh, in this uh, fashion of cooking. Well, you can do it here. And look at all the different things that we're cooking. Veggies. You can uh, roast fruit in here. You can do... That prime rib is so dang good. It's ridiculous how delicious that was. Whole cloves of garlic like you can put uh, inside here. Anything that you could put, think about it outside of the grill, you can put inside here. And with the addition of the baskets and the gloves and the rotisserie carving station, we give you a recipe book. And don't forget that Forbes also has available, uh, come on back over here, Forbes also has available that um, that cookbook, the rotisserie cookbook. And you know what, I have a very, just between, I have a very limited amount of cookbooks. If you want this, I gotta tell you, all She's the recipes taking are taking away the prime breakfast. rib. Oh, I know. Oh, she, everybody in the studio is actually after that. This is yeah, fun. I know. This is even more fun than exercising. I'm mm. gonna have to do more food. What do you guys think? Mm. So I love garlic. I'm a nut. The hell, one of the healthiest thing, things on the planet is roasted garlic. But now you can do all of these cloves. Look how beautiful this looks. We do this for a dinner party. Mm -hmm. It actually, talk about being a rock star. This is why you go to a restaurant, because they know how to do this. I didn't. Between this book, my rotisserie, and all the genius that's Ronco, I look really smart in the kitchen. Yeah. And this book is fantastic, okay. by the way. It's loaded with great full-color pictures, step-by-step -step instructions. So if you're looking, and it's all suited for uh, for cooking in your rotisserie, you know, even if you just start doing your own chickens, I'm telling you, <clears throat> it can save you so much money because when you start doing things like roasting chickens, you can do things like connecting meals. So you can take that chicken that's left over and you can make chicken salad and then you can make uh, chicken soups and you can do that with uh, with any of the beef dishes or the pork dishes you did as well. Uh, but here's here's that book and really loaded, loaded, loaded with all kinds of great ideas. You know, we worked really hard on making it be that easy to do because again, I'm not a chef and I'm gonna stand here as somebody who's been in the fitness industry for most of my life. Your body is made in the kitchen to make healthy, delicious choices. You can go get a rotisserie chicken in the store. You don't know what's on it and it's expensive. It's also not fun for the family. When you literally come home and the concept of set it and forget it, how about making a dessert in your rotisserie? Taste your little roasted peaches. Mm. Yeah, those are great. And you see the mm. whole interaction when you can have this mm. much fun with your food. I know people who love to cook. By the way, that's great for you guys. This is the perfect addition to your already oven because most of what you cook in your roast, it sits in its own fat. The concept of rotating food, allowing the juices to go, and then the genius of this fat drip tray. I'm going to come right around here mm. because if you can drip off, I shouldn't probably do it while it's going, but you can't quite see it. See, all right. Great safety thing. When I went to pull this out, the entire rotisserie stopped. Yep. I love that so that you can't screw up, which mm -hmm. I've done before. The nice thing is there's all that fat down there. I'm going to turn it back on, and we are good to keep going. I'm back. Let me turn on my turkey again. This is the rock star of my Thanksgiving this year, Check though. Check it out. Yeah, and that's, a, what, a 15-pound you said you had inside there? Look at the size of it. And also look at the color. <clears throat> and what's nice about a rotisserie chicken is the whole thing browns all the way around, not just on the top. And you're not going to get that burn mark. You know, when you cook a turkey in an oven, you really got to keep your eyes on it. Because, uh, you know, when I do mine, I mean, you have to cover it in foil. You have to do all this stuff. You don't have to do that with this. You simply slide it on. Uh, you can put stuff inside the cavity, just like you do. Uh, if you want to put some uh, some uh, celery onions I'm sorry, on I had stuff. to bring this back. Bring the right, prime because rib back. Because everybody yeah. all over the studio is eating it. And I got to say, if you missed this, because I know it's so early in the morning, this to me is the rock star of what, what we made today. Yeah. Not only is it delicious, crispy on the outside, mm -hmm. but my family, this was our big treat. We used to go out like once a month and maybe get a roast beef dinner. Maybe yeah. not even that. Maybe it was just holidays because I didn't grow up with any money. Mm -hmm. So I have this great thing about prime rib. To be able, I mean, I made my first one at home, guy. My kids looked at me and they were just over. It's like, oh, mommy, yeah, look fun. what you did. Yep. And for someone like me who just is not that good in the kitchen, I got to tell you, when you look at this and you look at how juicy this is mm -hmm. and all the things that I talk about, about healthful eating, and you see the amount of juices, you mm -hmm. see this yeah, flowing out. Perfect. 
This yep. is perfectly cooked. And you'll know exactly how to cook it based on its weight. That's in the cookbook as well. So very, very simple to go. And if you love uh, just uh, any kind of a, a, a delicious meal that is so simple to prepare. You know, normally these things can be very challenging in a traditional oven, but when you do it inside this oven, I mean, this stuff is, and it's literally melting in your mouth. And the outside, there's a crust on the outside. That's really important to have there. See how it goes all the way around? That's what's holding in all that juice, and it gives, and you get so much flavor in a prime rib from the exterior of it. And uh, seasoning tip, uh, I'm telling you, very basic. I do onion powder, garlic powder, salt and pepper. That's really all you need to put on the outside of that. Don't try to fancy it up with anything else. Very simple, let the meat's flavor come through. And you can see even, uh, look at how beautifully that is caramelized all the way around in a circle. Perfect. And then on the inside, it's got that perfect sort of uh, so, medium. You know, medium you've cook. been in the kitchen a lot. You've seen a lot of cooking products. Mm -hmm. What do you think about this? You know what? For me, for the money, for the size of this thing, it's a no-brainer. Now I had a convection oven in my oven, or in my uh, where I worked, and it was a rotisserie convection oven. I think it was eight, 20, 2800 bucks is what we had to that expect was, for yeah, that. That makes sense. And you could do two giant prime ribs in there. We just did a prime rib that would feed a family of four or six, and we did it in a fraction of the time, and we did it right in the comfort of our own home. And you know. What's nice, too, when you go out and get a prime rib, they're not ridiculously expensive. They're not like beef tenderloin or anything like that. So they're still a great family meal, but I think most people are afraid to cook them. They don't know really how to do it. This is so simple. I mean, it's it's pretty much put it in, turn the button. Set it and forget set it. Set it and forget it. Well, because I've been afraid to cook a lot of this. So, But I want to show you just one more time the variety, especially for me in terms of vegetables. Mm -hmm. The fact that you can cook your squash over here, your Brussels sprouts here, a chicken here. It is easy to clean. Like I said, your fat tray just comes right out. And how yummy is that? That if you've got any fat drippings, mm -hmm. it comes here. And then, by the way, this is extra, but you, do you ever cook ribs on your barbecue? Yeah. Okay, well, again, there's a rib cage that you can get for the most, I'm talking scrumptious. When yeah. you do ribs in the Ronco or Tissue oven. Can you see? Can you see? I don't know if you guys can here, come right, right now. I can actually, here, come here. Let's you can open it up this. and show everybody how those are. Now, those don't have any sauce on them, which is the way to do it. Put your sauce on later, uh, but you uh, you can season them and then slow cook them inside there. And again, ribs. Oh my gosh! Ribs have a tendency to burn very easily outside on the grill because of the high fat content. But here, you see how the fat channels its way down. It's dripping down to the bottom. And pork, you know, certain cuts of pork like uh, pork um, sparrows have a lot of fat in them. Right. So you don't have to deal with it. Just let it do its own thing. And you see how it's bubbling from inside? Let me show you something You're getting else. that nice caramelization. There, while Man. we're back here, there's another feature that once it's actually cooked and you want to just keep it out here because maybe the family hasn't shown up yet, you can actually press the no heat button and let it continue to rotate, especially yeah. for your meats and mm -hmm. your chicken. The just stay in there. The nice thing is that you've got that option right here in front of you. It truly yeah. is a set it and forget it concept. There's All there. Right. 60 seconds remaining. So let's go through some of the stuff that we did. We've roasted some fruit in here. We've done veggies. We've done a whole bunch of chickens. We've got a turkey that's we cooking made, in the front here. We did kebabs. We, made we did rib. prime rib. Uh, we've got uh, look zucchinis over there. you got lamb in there. The spare ribs. We've done all that using this one appliance. And think about it. If you just use your traditional oven, you're basically, here's what you're doing with your, you're taking a big bowl of fat and you're resting oh. meat in it and that's how it cooks. It cooks basically oh. in its own fat. So. Can you come down here for one sure. quick second? I'm sorry, I just kind of forgot down here. We wouldn't even talk about chicken wings, chicken wings. fish, uh, hamburgers, and of course your amazing ribs. The options to me, this cooks 101 different kind of foods. Mm -hmm. Everything right here in your, it just it looks good, it tastes good, and everyone says, Forbes, how do I right. diet? You don't need to, you need to eat good. That's right, you know what, it's, I, I, I'm a big fan of how the French eat. Uh, I don't need light butter.